The Berenstain Bears Around the World by Mike Berenstain. I can read, beginning one. The Bear family is visiting the Great Bear Museum. Dr. Bear shows them a globe of the Earth. We live right here, he says. It would be fun to travel around the world, says Sister. I agree, says Dr. Bear. Just follow me. Step inside my anywhere, any place machine, says Dr. Bear. He pushes a button. Everything starts to spin. When things stop spinning, they are in another country. Welcome to London, England, says Dr. Bear. The tower bell is called Big Ben. It makes a lot of noise, says Brother. Bing, bong, bing, bong, says Honey. Again, Dr. Bear pushes a button. Welcome to Paris, France, he says. This is the Eiffel Tower. It is 1,000 feet tall. You can climb to the very top. No thanks, says Brother. Switzerland is known for its clocks, says Dr. Bear, moving on. And its mountains, says Mama. And cheese with holes in it, says Papa. And chocolate, says Brother Bear and Sister. Yum, says Honey. In Venice, Italy, everyone travels by water, says Dr. Bear. You need a boat to cross the street, adds Papa. Russia is in the far cold north, says Dr. Bear. Its church domes are shaped like onions. I don't care for onions, says Sister. Egypt is part of Africa, says Dr. Bear. It is the oldest country on Earth. It is mostly desert, but the Nile River gives it water. Great buildings and statues of long ago stand here still. Much of Africa is covered by forest and plains, says Dr. Bear. Look, lions, says Brother. Roar, roar, says Honey. Hush, Honey, say Mama and Papa. In India, we can see the sights from the back of an elephant, says Dr. Bear. But watch out for tigers. Growl, growl, says Honey. Shh, say Brother and Sister. China has a long history, says Dr. Bear. And a long wall, says Brother. The Great Wall of China was built to keep enemies out, says Dr. Bear. It's wearing me out, says Sister. Australia has kangaroos, says Dr. Bear. They carry their babies in a pouch. So does the koala, but it looks like a teddy bear. We are near the South Pole, says Dr. Bear. Scientists and penguins live here, but little else. It is the coldest place on Earth. Grrr, says Brother. I'll say. South America is much warmer says Dr. Bear. Here great rainforests are home to many animals. What animal is that? asks Brother. It looks like a big beaver. It is a big beaver. It's a capybara, says Dr. Be Bear. Now we'll visit Mexico, says Dr. Bear. Great cities were built here long ago. Canada is north of Bear Country says Dr. Bear. It's a land of great natural beauty. Over half the lakes on Earth are here. Our own country is the USA, says Dr. Bear. United States of America. Alaska is way up north. Here we can join a dog sled race. Woof, woof, says Honey. Hawaii is an island state, says Dr. Bear. Surfers ride huge, long waves along its shores. A river dug out the Grand Canyon over millions of years, says Dr. Bear. The faces of presidents are carved on Mount Rushmore. Can you name them? The Statue of Liberty is in New York Harbor. She stands for freedom. And now, says Dr. Bear, we are right back where we started. The Bear family waves goodbye. Come back soon, says Dr. Bear. There are many more places to visit.
all around the world. If you like the content that we produce, please consider supporting us with a donation through our Patreon at patreon.com forward slash quiet books for bedtime. Donations allow us to purchase more books to read for the show. Thank you, and stay snuggly.